Hey y'all, welcome back. Um, today, as you can see, we're going to be planning in my Erin Condren Life Planner the week of February 5th through the 11th. This is how last week is turning out. This is using a kit from GP Sticker Studio. We are on Saturday. Okay, and this week we will be using a kit from um, Chloe Collectives. I've already hauled this on my channel, so I'm just going to do a quick flip through for it with you real quick. This all came with the kit. I didn't add anything on. I didn't do any add-ons. Add okay, so this is the kit I will be using from Chloe Collectors. This is her Roses Are Red kit. And like I said, these three little sheets were not an add-on. They came with the kit. Um, I believe this is like her ultimate kit or her deluxe kit, but it all came together. Okay. Um, I want to apologize for the noise. If you hear any garbage or dump trucks or anything like that, um, they are working. The park is right next to my house. It's on this side of my house. And, um... They are putting in a splash pad, so they will be working on it. Um, sorry, messing with my camera. They will be working on it probably all day today, so this is the only time I could film, so I am filming now. So, for this week, let's go over what I am using for washi. This is the washi I have this week. I'm also sorry for the light. I'm filming a little earlier today because I have a lot to do. So this is the washi for the week. These two came in a Michael's box, washi box. Um, this came in a Michael's uh, Valentine's Day roll. Oops. This is from the Target dollar spot, I believe. I got it uh, last year or something. These are also from um, Michael's rolls. So, those three right there. So these are what I'm going to be using for the banner. Um, the pen I will be using this week is a Papermate Ink Joy Gel Pen in a .7. It's the black tip. I felt it went best with the kit. Um, this is all my pre-planning for the week. This is a pad from Michaels, and it's, it's got a ton of sheets to it, so I'm trying to use it up. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and get started with my bottom washi, my... Um, weekend banner and cover these flags and do date covers and I'll be right back with you. Hey guys. Okay, like usual, I'm starting off with my bottom washi and then I am um, going to start on my weekend banner with the washi. Uh, the weekend banner is an idea from Nikki Plus 3. She is here on YouTube and she also has an Etsy shop and she does such a much better job than I do but um, she is the inspiration behind this. I saw her do it in one of her videos a while back. And ever since then, I've always had to include it in my planner. So, it gets included. And, um, I took some washi from the kit this time to just add a little bit more detail and to include the kit a little bit more into the washi banner. Uh, this week is not a very busy week, so there were there is not a lot of plans to be laid down. Um, so I'm super sorry about that, but we are still planning together. I'm taking the weekend banner from the kit, and I love this weekend banner on the, the ends. Instead of putting balls, she ended it like with little flowers on the end. It's so cute. Um, the flags she provided in the kit don't quite cover the entire flag that's in the Erin Condren, so I had to wipe some of it out. The other side gets covered by the date covers. You will see that in just a second. Um, she gives you two sets of date covers, so I had a really hard time deciding which one I wanted. But in the end, I ended up going with the red ones just because I didn't want to use the glitter ones at the top. I don't know why. I just felt like the red just looked better to me, especially with those little date dots she gives you. So I'm putting those up at the top. Um, so when I was pre-planning for this week, I was looking at my pre-planning going, oh my gosh, this is going to be the most boring video these people have probably ever seen. But 
I still wanted to get it up for you guys. Um, I have no basketball games this week like I usually do. There's nothing really that interesting going on. I'm starting on my sidebar. I'm taking that Roses Are Red quote box and putting that there. And I forgot to grab a couple of things out, so I had to go do that. Putting my um, habit tracker in and my custom header from Rose Color Days that says birth control. Um, Rose Color Days is not open right now. She just did the PBC sell, so she's catching up on her orders because she had a ton of orders. And I was one of them. <laughs> Um, then I'm putting my other custom header down from that says Grateful For. Um, this is an idea that I got from uh, Stick With Me. She is here on YouTube and she also has an Etsy shop. I just like to mark something that I'm grateful for every single day of the week. So that is what I use my weekly box for. And that weekly box was giving me so much trouble. And I'm sorry the sun came out at this point. So it gets really bright for a little while. But it goes away. Um, I am putting down a, a washi strip and the Instagram header that is from Paper and Gumption. Taking my paper paper company little Instagram icon and a checklist from the kit. I, wa I washed over that last line because I wanted to put some of that deco down. I love that she gives you this full sheet of deco. It was so much fun playing with this and trying to decide what I wanted to do. So, starting on Monday, like I said, not many plans at all. Start off with a glitter header, and then um, I put down a half box, because Monday is actually our 100th day of school. So, um, I wanted to put that, and I put down the balloons from the kit for my class, what we do to celebrate the 100th day of school is I hide 100 kisses in the classroom and they have to find them. And they get to eat the kisses, they're theirs, but every single year I have done this, we can't find like at least five of the kisses. I just don't know what I've done with them. And at the end of the year when we have to kind of clean up and pack up our room, I find them. And <laughs> they're just there. But it's happened every year where I just, there's a couple of kisses that I just can't find. So I put one of those full boxes down and then put um, a glitter header. And that was my favorite full box. I love the one with the dog. And she gives you three of those three heart checklists in the kit, but I need five throughout the day. So that's why I cut um, some of those full box checklists that she gives you. I don't need the whole full box. I just focus on three things. Three main things a day in this planner. I put my full box down at the bottom. And you will see in this planner, I forget a lot of things. So I have to go back and put things back on other days. And um, so there's there's my work and my workout boxes. They are both from um, Little Miss Papery. I love her boxes. The little hint of glitter that she does in just the word is just a perfect touch. That tennis shoe is from... Panda Bird Designs. And you get this huge sheet of those tennis shoes put on it. It was like an amazing, for amazing price. Okay. So on Wednesday, I just put my full box, my work box, my glitter header with my heart checklist, and then my workout box at the bottom, flipping over to Thursday. Glitter header. And then, what? I, oh, here I am putting my trash down. Oh, but wait, because I realized that I forgot to put my mill things down. So I'm putting those down. These are all from the kit. She doesn't provide little things, but she does provide, like, icons. Like, cut out icons of mills and TVs and um, Happy Mail things that you would see in, I guess, little things. So on Thursday, we have picture day. I took that picture day script from the teacher, the green teacher Mambi sticker book. I am, I picked the, oh gosh, Miranda Clever Y'all Crafts colorway bows this week. Um, that is to mark a video that's going up. And then I put my work box down and then a full box. And then I do my checklist here. And I cut both of these checklists crooked, so yeah. 
I had to kind of cover up the top of the box a little bit. Sorry if you heard that. That's my boyfriend. He's playing his game upstairs right now. Workout box with the same tennis shoe from Panda Bird Design and my the icon from the kit to mark my meal on to Friday. And somewhere in this, it cuts off, and I'm so sorry about that. There's my full box glitter header, and then I'm going to put checklist down, and then it cuts off. There you go. Then we're back over to Wednesday because I realized I wanted to put that we need to lesson plan on this day. That lesson plan sticker, uh, script sticker is from Sweet Ava paper, Sweet Ava's paper. And I took a um, computer from the kit and kind of put those together. Back over to Friday. I'm taking the yellow teacher sticker book and taking the time to grade. And I'm going to layer um, the coffee from the kit over that. I just like to use coffee to mark when I'm grading because it usually takes a while. I took the blow bow clip from Inky and the Brain to mark a reminder. Um, at this moment, I cannot remember what the reminder is. And then I took that paper and gumption little girl with the balloon to mark that we are having a girls' night. We are getting together at one of the ladies that I work with house, and we are going to be painting. One of the girls we work with um, teaches at painting with a twist. So we all got to pick out a painting that we wanted to do, and she's going to teach us how to do it. Oh, the bow clip was to say that um, Valentine's are due. Valentine and Valentine boxes are due that day for the kids. And then I put a scallop box with a little clock in it to, to signify that we have a dental presentation. On to Saturday, I put another bow down to mark that I have a video. A Squirrel Prince Co. YouTube box to mark that I need a film. A box with a vacuum to mark that I need to clean the, the um, office. And then washi with a um, laundry sticker. And then a full box or half box. <laughs> With a paper and gumption boy and girl to mark a date night. Hopefully we'll get to have the date night. I think I put it in my planner for the past three weeks and it just hasn't happened. Shopping. Grocery shopping on the top of um, Sunday. There's my bow for my video. My Squirrel Prince Co. box for filming. And the box uh, with the spray bottle for cleaning the kitchen. And then a half box for pizza night. I'm taking the pizza um, from Inky and the Brain. And that is it. Oh, I fiddled with this for a while and that is it. Okay, guys, I am back. I filled everything in with my, like I said, I was going to use the Paper Mate Inkjoy gel pen in a .7 in black. I added my clip to the top. This is from Two Little Bow Babies on Etsy. And I added my deco, just a little bit of deco. So let's flip through and see what we have left in the kit. I have some deco left over, some glitter headers, another set of date covers, um, oops, some quarter boxes, some uh, more um, checklist, or yeah, checklist. Some boxes, some scallops, some washi, a lot of functional, but this will probably get used throughout the week, and two half boxes and a um, appointment label. All this will get used in my um, mini planner, so it will not go to waste. And this is how this week turned out. And that is it, guys. I will see y'all next time. Bye, y'all.